Grand Phoenix Rising, beautiful souls. Kundalini Rising, beautiful souls. I hope you guys are doing amazing. Welcome to my channel if you're new here. I'm TK, aka Moon. Today I've got a collective message for you guys. Please remember this won't resonate for everyone, so take a resonate, sleep with doesn't. And let's get into it, yeah? I said I just got a buck. Get into it, yeah. All right. I, I feel like I'm talking to someone who's very, 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 very smart, okay? You're very, very intelligent. I'd say you're someone with a very sharp mind, almost to the point where, you know, you could intimidate people sometimes with the way that you speak. You know, some of you may have what we call a, a resting bitch face. Um, but, like, when I say you got weapons, you got weapons, right? You got weapons to protect yourself um, and mental weapons at that. Um, I feel like whoever this reading is for, there's something that you're desiring to... Some of you may be wanting to work, to get a job, or there could be something that you're wanting to focus on um, yourself, right? If you notice this woman here, she's kind of barefoot, so whatever you want to do, it's like very freeing, you know? It's like this, <laughs> it's like running through nature barefoot. It's something that you're, you're passionate about, and she's got a, a painting, uh, what do you call it, thingamajiggy there. So yeah, that, like, like maybe some of you want to paint, okay? Maybe some of you want to tap more into your like creative energy. Maybe you've spent a lot of your life, you know, using your logic and your mental energy, right? Mastering this element. And then now it's like you want to apply your creative energy, but in a practical way. You know, maybe some of you, I'm really getting a painter. Whoever I'm talking to, like, oh my gosh. No, it's giving like someone that went and studied something in school and then wants to become like an <laughs> like have a creative business is what I'm getting so it's a big shift that you've been through in your life right and I can tell you one thing you definitely have the brains for it all right in the shadow position we have the world so what this is telling me is that for some of you this thing that you want to work on it could be online but for the most part this is telling me that your guides your angels your ancestors have assisted you recently to complete a cycle all right to learn some type of type of lesson there's <laughs> there's like this energy of um divine protection around you like rewards around you right now um basically there's nothing that's really in the <clears throat> it's almost as if you have the entire world in your hands whoever i'm talking to like you could have a very creative mind or streak to you but i I don't know why, but I feel like this is shocking or it's so different to something that, like, you used to do. So, yeah, let me know if that resonates, okay? Because for you, Collective, if you're resonating with this, with the death card here, it's saying that there is a major change going on in your life right now, okay? Some of you may not even recognize that you're going through a such a big transformation, okay? And this transformation is renewing your passion for something, Um or sparking a passion for something. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, this has a lot to do with you. I'm going to say working. Some of you may want to have a community around you or the work that you want to do. You may want to bring people together, like actually physically close together um, in a similar room or... You may want to work with other people. Um, some of you may want to do some kind of work to do with relationships. This could be like a counseling position or well, it's almost like a creative expression type of position. <laughs> I don't even know like how to explain this, but that's what I'm getting. For some of you, on top of that, I see you might want to do something out in nature um, or you might enjoy time in nature watering plants or something like in a nursery so i'm getting someone could be doing pot pot pottery um or doing something with flowers okay or like nature and plants is what i'm getting and oh my god like i just feel like you've been through a big switch up i can't deny this feeling that i'm getting right and i think that your guides, your spirit team, they're definitely celebrating you right now because you've got some kind of key, right? You've got a successful outcome to a problem 
and you are on the road to success. Now, I do feel like for some of you, you do got this like evil eye kind of energy around you at this time, but I do feel like you will be freed from that. Any doubts, any confusion, anything that you're uncertain about, right? Anything right now that your intuition isn't clear about, it will become very clear, okay? I see what I get is source energy sort of just kind of beaming through for you guys and just guiding the way for you. You know what I mean? Um, obviously, you have to embrace the transformation that you're undergoing, but uh, yeah, don't be surprised. I feel like don't be surprised if you do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say you have potentially one or two people that could be talking about your success behind your back because this fly is carrying on you know so that just means that you know some of you got people that are that are jealous of you right so just be cautious you know moving forward but i think that you're very very smart you already kind of know this some of you could already be waiting for you may already know who these jealous people are right you're just waiting for them to to do what they're supposed to do <laughs> Okay, when I say you have a seriously lucky period coming into your life, you genuinely do. Tell us more about this. Okay, you're about to do something risky, baby. If you ain't doing it already, you're doing something risky. Like, you know, you could be embodying this tiger spirit animal right now. Okay, whatever you're risking, it's bringing in money towards you. Right? I feel like this is a very practical... Um, leap of faith that you're taking on yourself oh my gosh what did i just say like whoever you are you are a very graceful creator okay you really know how to use your creative energy for in some way or another you do or you're learning how to you're learning how to channel it into things okay you're learning how to express your creative energy communicate your creative energy in a way that it could be through something other than just verbally right you may have been someone that's so used to explaining yourself verbally but it's like now there's another way it's like you have other ways to express yourself right and your imagination is really the the limitation <laughs> so how woke is that third eye how lit up is that third eye hmm how lit up is that third eye? That's what Spirit's saying. I feel like you guys are very aware. And as a matter of fact, if anything, because I see some of you are struggling a little bit with your intuition and maybe in the near future, especially the month up ahead, what Spirit's saying is if you can listen to it, listen to anything to do with the third eye frequency, okay? Put crystals on your third eye. Tie bandanas on your head with crystals on your third eye. Listen to third eye frequencies. Um, but ensure that you're also grounding yourself as well because, you know, when you're playing with your third eye, it's like, um, you know, you want to make sure that you're grounded as well, okay? Because right now you're being explored to, you're being called. You know how funny that is? This is what your intuition is telling you to do, to explore different avenues of doing something, okay? The wombat is going gonna, is gonna to make like eight different barrels, or tunnels until it finds the one that it's really happy with and for some reason this is what this is <laughs> giving me like you could be desiring to create something right now but it's like you know you've got to explore with it you know what I mean and then eventually you're gonna get very nesty and very comfy when you find exactly how you want to do what you want to do I'm telling you you're gonna be celebrating and some of you you're gonna be celebrating with other people as well that's what I could see So another thing that's also changing in whoever's energy I'm in is that, like I was picking up on these kind of jealous individuals before, I feel like you are not somebody who is just feeding into that anymore. Maybe in the past you used to do it like because, because you can, right? Because you can kind of one-up people on a mental level, but I'm seeing that you've stopped kind of being genuine with certain people, you know, because not everybody deserves your genuine nature and not everybody deserves your your downloads your intuitive your intuition right your creativity because you're someone who's mastered yeah you gotta have serious evil ire somebody got somebody whoever you are 
definitely evil eye coming out here. Um, but yeah, you are like a monster. You know, you are monstering your intuition right now. And right spirits just saying balance. Okay, ba and I'm hearing balance your third eye because um, anything that you're kind of confused about, even right now, it's you're gonna have so much clarity. And I see you just jumping up and down like there's so much childlike joy c coming out of this energy, like, like yay, <laughs> you know, and just strengthening your faith in the universe right some kind of emotional healing is going on i feel like this is a result of you you are you might have a high iq okay but what i'm getting is for some reason right now you're in a cycle where you're almost about to prove to the universe how much of a high eq you have as well right if there was a creative <laughs> q <laughs> you'd have a high one okay you guys let me know if this resonates for you. Remember to like and subscribe. Gratitude for your um, time for watching this 1111. If you guys appreciate this content, please like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next readings. Peace to the Cosmic Tribe.